All right, the NBA draft upcoming. Uh, John Wall, let's start there. Like him, great athlete. Star. Like him, I think he's going to be a a star. Don't know about off the court issues. Uh, you know, when you saw the Kentucky bench a lot this year, they were fighting with each other or the coach. <laughs> so I mean, but but he is a he is an NBA talent, legit size, athletic ability, skill level, and confidence. Um, he's got a toughness. He's really good. And you know Jordan Crawford being in the 18 at St. Louis and a name that's come up as possible. Great talent, scoring machine, middle game, all the way game, misdirection game, um, tremendous talent. He looks so good, can score on anyone, and yet he's picked maybe 25. Is there a question about... A a little bit about character, the transfer issue, and I think the other thing is his willingness to defend and, and... you know, sometimes when there is no bad shot for you in the program and you go to a team like the Bucks, where there's a lot of potent offensive scoring around you and your shots diminish and you don't have that carte blanche, I, I think there's a question about that psychologically. I, I certainly would have one. You know Utah well and Wesley Matthews, I think, shocked the NBA. He's with no one. He's a free agent and he was well, he, a major player. He, I don't care what they, what they say. They, there's a ceiling to which they can... Go the the Jazz will match that they love him. Um, he's a cerebral player. Of the three freshmen that came in, I thought McNeil was the most competitive, and I thought that Wesley was the most smart. I think he, I think he makes good decisions. His defensive spacing is good. His defensive inclinations are good. Uh, his body's outstanding, and you know again. Darren Williams takes all bets off, and he's playing with a veteran cast, a Boozer, Mehmet Okur. You know, he's, he almost has the perfect team to play along with for insinuating himself in the lineup as a rookie, you know. And you're going to get win 500 Division One basketball. Did you ever dream? or at no, 100? no, I never even thought I'd win five games. I mean, I was a, you know, walk-on. I mean, I, I, I and, and that's a tribute to players. I mean... I realize that every good coach does. I mean, it's the Andre Millers out there. I was looking up today. Andre, you know, was something like 26th on the all-time assist list. It, Oscar Robertson was 10th, and that, that shot me. You know, Jabbar is 24th. That shot me because I knew how unselfish he was. But just think about all the great guards that have played this game, and the 24th leading assist guy in the history of the NBA is the greatest leading scorer. and the seven foot one, seven foot two, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. Thanks, sir. Hey, you're welcome. Thank you.